well, not a bad way to kick the morning off. It just so got light enough that I could start to see around. Got the camera out and was filming. I don't even know what I was filming. The tree right in front of me or the, the rain coming off the tree. And just like that, I heard something coming. Spun the camera around and here comes that small buck. So that's a great start. It's kind of cold, wet, mixed between showers on and off. A little bit of snow mixed in. But it's November now and it's time to go. So wet, cold, it doesn't matter. You better be in the stand. 26 years ago today, I was not in a deer stand. I was in a church getting married. Actually, 26 years and a couple of hours. I got married at 9 a.m. How many people can say that? Only an early rising farmer would do that, but well, I'm gonna settle in. I can't wait to see what happens this morning. Hopefully a bigger buck will come past and I can get my wife an anniversary gift. Boy, wouldn't she love that. Hunting Farmers 2023 deer season is brought to you by New View Hunting. Keep silent, stay hidden. Everything is new except your view with New View Hunting Products. Also brought to you by Camo Jojo. Manufacturer of the Camo Jojo Trace, a live view LTE cellular trail camera, and the Camo Jojo double solar panel. Camo Jojo, connect with nature. It has been a frenzy of activity and unfortunately I'm catching very little of it on camera. The absolute joy of the rut is that there's deer running around chasing, grunting, and I'm seeing all that. I'm just struggling to get it on camera. I had deer blowing, uh, snorting in front of me. I had no idea why my wind uh, was good so I knew it couldn't be that. It's a thicket and I couldn't see them but they were just snorting and snorting. Pretty soon they took off running and I could just catch a glimpse of the tails and as soon as they ran a buck was chasing them, running, running around, sounding like a herd of elephants in the thicket. Uh, I could just catch glimpses of them every now and then and I don't know if I ever got them on camera. 
but that was exciting to see. I couldn't even tell how big he was, uh, but he was definitely chasing those does, and they weren't impressed. After all that settled down, I pulled out my grunt tube, grunted a couple of times. Within seconds, a buck from a different direction came running towards me. At first, I thought it was a definite shooter, but the closer he got, uh, he was high and wide, but he didn't have many points. He came running down the hillside towards me. I was struggling to try and get the camera on him. He jumped the creek down here below me and then just disappeared. I never saw him again. It is very thick in front of me, but somewhere he just disappeared in it and he never uh, came close enough that I could actually get a really good look at him. While he was running down the hillside towards me, there was two other bucks behind me that I could hear fighting. I could hear them crashing the horns together. I tried to look back there to see them. It had to be within 100 yards, or it sounded like within 100 yards. Never did lay eyes on them, but. So between that buck, first thing this morning, then that one chasing the doe, had the one that responding to my grunt call and heard at least two more fighting behind me. Uh, it has been absolute crazy, perfect type of November morning that you dream about. So I'm going to keep taking in the show. It's been an awesome morning so far. That was a little bigger six point there. He was definitely a little bit older of a deer. Came right underneath me. I mean, he was, I looked behind me, he was running towards me. Tried to turn the camera on, I did turn the camera on. Followed him, filmed him, come right underneath me. Three yards away from my stand. Ran right past me here. Just laid down some beautiful footage with the camera. Only to realize I never hit record. <laughs> Again, I'm gonna have to fire myself as a cameraman. Uh, I am struggling here this morning, but that was another great encounter. I cannot stress how cold it is here this morning. The sun tried to peek out here once or twice, but it's just been on and off spritzing and windy and in the low 30s. And I'm simply not used to this type of weather yet, but what a blast it's been uh, in the whitetail woods this morning. Well, my hunt on my anniversary the other day ended without any more deer sightings, but you're gonna wanna stay tuned for the next hunt because I broke out the crazy decoy and I had some action. So you're gonna wanna stay tuned for that. Before I go, I want you to check out the Camo Jojo Cellular Trail camera. Right now they're running their biggest sale of the season. In fact, if you use my discount code and with this sale, I believe the price is down around $90 for this cell camera. Get some amazingly clear videos. And the best part is you can actually have videos sent directly to your phone almost immediately after they're taken. You don't get just a preview or have to request the video to see it. If you have it on video mode, it'll send that video right to the app. I really like the camera. And hey, if you have an anniversary coming up, 
Maybe get one for the wife. She'll probably love you for it. So that's it for today's video. Stay tuned for the next video. You don't want to miss that. Until then, I want to thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.